Life under regular circumstances rarely seems easy, but the struggles we have had to endure over the last couple of years have been even harder. Pandemic, recession, societal divisions, higher costs for gas and groceries. I know it's been tough on everyone, but through all the challenges the world throws at us, we have to keep moving forward. And your county government is doing the same thing. Supervisor Fletcher early on was uh, one of the instrumental partners with the San Diego Foundation in launching our COVID response fund. The past three years, the county's investments in parks like this have been so critical to providing resources for the community to be able to get outside, to reconnect to their environment, but also to one another. IBEW has always been an advocate for communities of concern. We really value the policies that Nathan Fletcher has spearheaded like child care vouchers, uh, internet access for them that we have actually helped install. Also, green energy jobs, and we need more union jobs that are friendly to the environment that we can all profit and you know, grow from. I learned how to get a job, how to do interview, how to be a good worker. Then I get a job in a hotel. Ended up being homeless, but like, Thank the Lord that there was people that were um, able to help me out and actually put me back on my feet now. More than 500 individuals will reside in Prosper. And then in addition to that, there are 60 units here that will be supported through the county on an ongoing basis. This is made possible through the collaboration of, of many partners and especially the county of San Diego and specifically County Supervisor Nathan Fletcher. One of the things that we've learned quite a bit is the need in downtown um, for us to have a mobile crisis response team that's able to help folks that are suffering from behavioral type challenges. Um, and we're just extremely thrilled that the county is now launching this mobile crisis response team throughout the entire region. We were on the brink of going out of business completely and Supervisor Fletcher stepped in, the county stepped in, gave us a grant back in October, September of last year and that really gave us a lifeline to continue business and to continue going. That actually opened up the possibility for us to do a roasting department, now sell online. As you've just heard, we have been focused on taking action, on getting things done, not just talking about it. Driving transformational change, making historic investments in our future. We have fought every day to make your life better in every way we can. And that drive will never stop. We are and will always be a county government that you can count on.